Oh, okay. So, can I is it focus? Okay. Hey guys. <laughs> this one's so sturdy. So, today I'm gonna be doing a skincare routine, and the reason why I look like this is because I was gonna film the in intro with makeup on and then like take it off and then do a skincare routine. But then I started crying. So, I look like this. And it's fine. But yeah, I just. But yeah, so I don't. <laughs> oh my god. So, anyways, so yeah, I'm doing a skincare routine. <gasps> What's saying? Yeah, I look like a mess, but I'm fine. Anyways, yeah, I'm filming a skincare routine today because this has been asked for a lot, and I was like, okay. I'm gonna start so I don't look like this anymore. So the makeup wipes I use are the Kirkland ones. They're from Costco. I used to use the Neutrogena ones, but those are so oily. Um, why is that song so loud for? Oh wait, I hope that doesn't last a long time. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I used to use the Neutrogena ones, but those are really oily and they just really bug me. Sometimes when I use eyeshadow, I use like a makeup remover water thing, but makeup wipes are just so much easier than anything else. And I'm all about convenience. I'm gonna do a little explanation about my skin and my routine. My skin is dry and if I'm being honest, I've never had Acne prone skin. This is like the first time that my skin has been like Not as good as it usually has been. That doesn't make any sense. I don't want to say it's bad because it's definitely not But like it's not Clear you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm not complaining But like I really haven't had to like keep up with my skin or like had much of a routine because my skin Hasn't ever been not super super clear I'm tired, but it's fine. What was I saying? I was saying something about- oh yeah. But anyways, what I'm trying to say is my skin hasn't really ever been like very not clear. I don't want to say bad because I don't really like, think there's such a thing as bad skin, but like I'm not a skincare expert at all. But I'm gonna go and start my routine and I'm sorry if this stuff is expensive. Like even drugstore skincare is pretty expensive. Because skincare is just expensive in general, which is kind of rigged. Um, but anyways, so I do this twice a day, except for the mornings. For the mornings, I just do two cleansers and then a toner and then moisturizer. So for the first cleanser, I do more of a gentle one. One that is mostly just to clean your skin. I either use this one or this one. This is the Pharmacy Ultra Gentle Facial Cleanser. And then this one is the Indie Lee something face wash. I do a couple of squirts. I'm scared to close my eyes because I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep. I'm just so tired. I don't have to <laughs> you. But am I wrong? No. But is it fine? Yes! My face is still wet. That's because I'm about to put more cleanser on it. This is wet. For what? Yes? Ansys Mirad. I don't think I'm saying that right. I burn And for what? Anyways, I really like their cleansers. I have like three of them. This is an anti-aging acne one. These are like $30, but there's a lot in them. Sometimes I use a brush, like an exfoliator brush with this one, but I don't feel like using it right now, so I'm not. Then I use the Glossy A Solution Exfoliating Skin Perfector. I've like not almost out of this, but relatively almost out. I just get a cotton pad and then, and then... So I just do this, and then I don't really know. Yeah, I use that. I don't always do face masks at night, just because sometimes I'm just not in the mood for it. I either use this one. It's the Herbivore Blue Tansy Resurfacing Clarity Mask. This one's also really good. These are both for like clarifying, obviously. This is an Aztec clay mask. I think this is like $11 on Amazon. I use this with apple cider vinegar, which is smells terrible, but it works better than with water. And this makes your skin really soft for no reason. And I let that sit for like 10-20 minutes. 
Sorry, I fell asleep. I rinsed that off and I don't know if I mentioned this, but so over all those two face masks, I personally like the Aztec clay one more just because I feel like it's more effective. But with that, I would only do that like once a week. With the one I just used, I do that one like twice or three times a week. Now I do toner. It's Glossier Super Glow Serum. It's just vitamin C basically. But yeah, I put that on. This is, I don't know how to say it. I used this. And then I also use this, it's... And then I use this one. Then I use this, it's the same brand from the other toner. It's like a serum version of that toner, I think. But I use them together because I feel like it's more effective. And then I moisturize. I either use the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Moisturizer, it's like this. Or I use the same brand, I don't, I don't wanna say it. It's probably not that difficult or complex, but anyways. These two, this is the moisturizing sorbet. This has more like fruit ingredients in it. I think today I'm gonna use this one. And I really hope this is in focus. I just can't really tell, so I'm sorry. I used the Dr. Chart Tiger Grass Cream. I was gonna get the serum version of this, but it was more expensive, so that's why I have the cream. I rub this in. The only reason I don't always use this is because it's really thick. And sometimes it makes me a little uncomfortable. So this is the Sunday Riley UFO Acne Treatment Face Oil. Riley's. I'm super sorry. This is really expensive. It's like $80. And I'm super sorry to mention that. I hate saying that. I'm so sorry. But it's really good. And it works really well. And it smells really nice. It's really good. And it's really expensive. But it's very good. Like I wouldn't recommend something this expensive if I didn't think it worked well. So. You put this all over. It's so nice. Then I use this Kate Somerville Somerville Firming Eye Cream. This is also very expensive. I'm super sorry. Any eye cream is fine. My eyes are just dry. Yeah, I just use this and I put it underneath my eye and I tap. I lastly go in with a toner, but a misting toner because for some reason I feel like it's necessary. I either use theirs, Witch Hazel. It's just their toner, but in their mist or i use the herbivore jasmine green tea one honestly let's just go ahead and use both just to just really make this super special <sighs> okay and then for my chapstick i just use this cinnamon lip balm from young living i feel like this is the only chapstick that's like ever worked for me that doesn't make me want to bite my lips off. So that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Anyways, that's it. I'm probably gonna go sleep now. Just kidding. I'm gonna edit this because I want to put it up on the internet. Yeah, I'm gonna go. But thanks for watching and I will list everything down below. Okay. Bye. Okay, bye. <laughs>